My name is Tony, and I'm a pit bull named Sadie. I'm always asked about why I chose to own such a difficult breed, and the only answer that I really can give is love and devotion those dogs give you. I've never really met a pit bull that's under good ownership, of course, that has not been the most caring social animal. The devotion they give us is, is reason enough for me to make my decision. My parents were very much against it. Um, I had to get it without their consent. My mom was very afraid of her at first, but after a while, they ended up building a great relationship with her. And over the past summer, Sadie ended up living with her, and they were so attached to her that when I left, they ended up getting their own first dog, which is also a pit bull. Her name's Kaylee. Pit bulls are known to be people-loving dogs, wonderful family dogs. Most people, upon first meeting her, support the myths about them. They hear them in the media. The myths are uh, they attack more than any other dog. They have locked jaws. They don't feel pain. All these things are obviously not true. I try to stop. I try to talk to the people. I try to sit her down and introduce Sadie. And like a normal pit bull trait, the dogs are loving to strangers like as if it was their own owner. And just a five-minute conversation with these people, and I feel like they leave with a totally different outlook on the breed. Sadie has the ability to build great relationships with any of my friends. My friends all have specific personal relationships with her, and if you ask any of them, they will tell you how loving she is and how much they now support the breed since meeting her. In my opinion, a responsible owner of a pit bull should make sure they are participating in obedience courses, both beginner and intermediate. That is to gain the necessary social skills and obedience in order to become well-behaved, and you learn how to interact with the dogs correctly. When I was originally researching where I should go and how I should do this, I ended up meeting Gareth. He, along with his wife, run Wiggle Butts, which is a nonprofit bully rescue organization. They dedicate their entire lives to rescuing pit bulls. A lot of things that they have to say are very relative to what my life is owning a pit bull. I currently go to classes with Gareth, where his dog Nino is also there. My name is Jen Evans, and my husband Gareth and I do bully breed rescue and rehabilitation. The reason that we want to help pit bulls is because approximately one in 600 pit bulls ever finds a home and the rest of them are euthanized. Uh, we, we always like to stand up for the underdog and can't believe how unfairly these dogs are judged. Our main goal is to educate people about pit bulls and when we do adoptions, we do have a very intense adoption screening process. We have a three-page application. We make sure we do home visits and all that kind of thing to make sure that they are being put in the right home and not in a bad environment. Sadie has now passed through the intermediate courses, which she now has the Canine Citizen Award. The next step for her will be to become a therapy dog. I think she'll be a great therapy dog because of the way she interacts with people and the way she can brighten up anybody's day. A positive thing about her being a therapy dog is she can be out in public interacting with people that would normally not see her or that breed. The relationship with her has changed me in so many ways. I wanted to share my life with a companion who's the most loving social dog. She's basically given my life purpose.